Hello fellow artists, my name is Roxanne and I'm teaming up with Marabou to show you how to go cray in an art journal using their mixed media art crayons. So grab a journal and let's dive right in. Ah uh, yes, let me introduce you to these bad boys first. Meet the Marabou Art Crayon. These super creamy crayons are highly pigmented and water soluble, so they're great for fine art or any mixed media project you might be working on. Now although they're water soluble, it's a wax based soft pastel, meaning you can use this product with both wet and dry techniques. Don't worry, we'll cover both of these in this video. The size and grip on these crayons make them easy to hold and handle, and also feature quite a bit of product with a retractable holder that gives you even more crayon. By the way, these come in 25 different colors, which you can buy in these wonderfully curated sets or individually. There's even a colorless blender, more on that a little later. So to keep things simple, I'm going to break this video into three ways you can use these art crayons in your journal. First, you can use them to build up a background. Working in a watercolor sketchbook, I'm going to scribble the crayon all over both pages. Once I've got some of the art crayon down, I can now come on top of them with water and a large brush to begin to fan out pigment. And these guys are really easy to use. Want to add more color? Simply put more crayon on top. Did you use too much water? Just blot some of it up with a paper towel. Ooh, texture. Something else I like to do with these crayons is nudge my line work a bit with a wet brush. This allows me to fan out just a little bit of color, but still maintain the integrity of the line I put down. It's a great way to continue to build up layers, but mix up the types of texture happening on my page. Now I'll just finish up this background by adding in some splatters. To achieve this, just scribble some of the crayon on some wax paper, add water with a fluffy brush, and splatter away. After building up my initial background and then layering in some ephemera, ooh, magic. Let's move on to the second way you can get cray with these crayons. And that's using them to create your visual element. After quickly sketching an idea directly onto my journal pages, I can then fill it using the art crayons and some paint. I'll begin by first scribbling in a block of crayon within my sketch. Then instead of using water like we did in our background, I'm gonna use some white paint. By mixing these art crayons with paint, I'll get that nice opaque pop that I'm looking for while retaining vibrant color. Another reason why the paint and crayon technique is great here is that now I can add detail on top of it. You can use a fine liner pen or apply ink with a detail brush, which is what I'm doing here. With the moths and scattered wings across my pages, I can now start to bring this journal spread to completion. And of course, what better way to finish my pages with pizzazz than with the art crayons to add in more color and texture. There's so many ways to pack in the detail, but I'll begin by using the crayon much like we did with our background, applying it directly onto my pages and then moving around the color with water. Because these crayons are so pigmented, I can even take remnant color that's just on my brush and put it into other areas of my page. To really add a pop of color, I'm gonna apply two crayons next to each other and blend them together. Now you can use a makeup sponge or even your finger to do this, but I really loved using Marabou's Colorless Blender to seamlessly smear color all over. Remember how I mentioned at the start of the video that you can use both wet and dry techniques? Well, this dry technique of blending or even scribbling with the crayon all over is perfect for journaling, as these crayons are wipe resistant after 24 hours. So after a bit of pen work and a little bit more ephemera to finish things off, here it is, my totally cray but completed journal spread. To learn more about Marabou Art Crayons, be sure to check out MarabouCreativeUSA.com. There you can find a retailer near you that carries them online or in store so you can go cray in your art journal.